Hi guys, Tan here, but you knew that already, and uh, this isn't going to be a good way of recording, is it? Hello, so, uh, today I just decided to, like, react to some old drawings and stuff that I've done. So, and I don't mean, by old, I don't mean, like, 2013 or 14, I mean, like, stuff from when I was 5 to 9. I've still got all the folders and stuff, and, uh, just thought it'd be interesting to see all the stuff that I've done, and maybe record it, because why not? And I need to upload more. Well, I dropped the camera, I'm smart. So, uh, here's one. And that is the Titanic. That is not how the front of a ship works. And I've got the angling all wrong there. The back funnel is way too far back, and I think that's supposed to be a black door or something. Nice dolphin, though. Um, that is some survivors coming back from the Titanic, I guess. And, um, that. That's a warship, I think. A lot of boat drawings already. Yeah. Okay. That is also the Titanic, and I'm just gonna. That's me. Probably gonna cut that part out because reasons. That is the Wahini, I think. Yeah. This, this book is full of boat drawings. Titanic again. Uh, Britannic. I don't think I. No, I never got to finish that one. Hmm. Uh, is this meant to be a, like a ancient war or something? Hmm, okay. A rusty bucket from Banjo-Kazooie. Oh, damn. Huh. Look at that spelling of bucket. And, hello, it's the Titanic again, and it's the Titanic again. Huh. Look at that. Oh, it's the Wahini this time, not the Titanic. I remember doing this actually because of this shading here. Still remember that. It's a pretty crazy thing to remember, but I remember it. Yeah, Titanic again, Wahini again. And is this a um Spinosaur no not Spinosaurus Dimorphodon, I think it is. That is a robotic polar bear. I don't have anything to say here, that's just weird. And um this is a helicopter with a train on its propeller. Interesting. Interesting imagining there. Wahini again. Oh, a tram, that's different. Melbourne tram with the power lines and stuff, and looks like some Banjo Kazooie stuff at the bottom, and. Oh. That is 9 11. That is 9 11. Wow. Judging by the look of that plane, looks like it's based off the plane from Madagascar. So I would have been about five or six when I drew this. That is 9-11. That is 9-11. This is the Leaning Tower of Pisa. It's fallen over for some reason. And uh, this is a Land Before Time drawing. Interesting. Very retarded, but interesting. Another book. Um, that is the Tangiwa Disaster, K949. Okay, oh, that's a huge um, driver, really huge driver. Would have been about nine, by the way I made this, I don't know. That's a train again. That is the Tangiwa Disaster again, oh great. That's a Tangiwa disaster again. Mm, that is a Tangiwa disaster again. Is this going to be like the other book, but instead of like um, boats, it's going to be trains? Diesel train and... Artist. Turn to Timahurangi. Yeah, before I changed my name. Does it say how old I was when I drew this? Not. No, but on the back there's uh, another train. Tongue Eye Disaster again, that ride. Okay, there's like no carriages there or anything. Also, that water's really detailed. KA910, oh, that's different. 
There was a 949 as well. Oh. Okay. Is that a boat in the background? <laughs> Looks like it. That is... Okay, 949 again. That is Edward from Thomas the Tank Engine, I believe. Really interesting face there. And that is, um, Thomas. 16th of May, 2009. Not 16th of May, that's when Godzilla 2014 came out. Um, K949 again. Interesting. Not really. And uh, is this the end of the book? I think it is. Okay. Yellow book. And Kuchimaru then. Oh yeah, I used to be a drummer. Forgot about that. No, oh, is this all just drum music? Oh. That was not as nearly as that was not ah, uh, I cannot have the English. That's a um Velociraptor. And that is a T-Rex. Very interesting Velociraptor design for past time. It is Petri from Land Before Time. That is... What is that? Is that a... That's like a giant lobster at a beach or something. <laughs> oh, that's me. That is... Oh, Snake and Lizard by Joy Carly. I remember that. And that's... That is Tigger from Winnie the Pooh. And whoa! Hello, old retarded way of drawing dinosaurs. Actually, it's pretty much the exact same nowadays. That is an anaconda. That is Spongebob. Okay, was not expecting that of all things. Finding a lot of stuff about me that I never knew before. That is a... Half robot, half real train. Why is it saying naked at the back? That is Tigger again. That's a robotic snake. And that is an Ankylosaurus, Stegosaurus hybrid with. Is that a gun out of its tail? It's weird. Weird design for us. That's a red anaconda. Very detailed on the scales there. That is a robotic snake again. What is it with me and robotic animals? That's a... Panda, I think? No, it's not a panda. It's a anteater? Something. That's Petri from the Land Before Time again. That's a Parasaurolophus. I can't put the pronunciation up there. That's a... Ammonite. This is like the dinosaur book and that is a black Allosaurus. Very, very long Allosaurus, geez. How do you keep that balance? Oh look at that arm curve, that's not natural. And this is a blue blue page. The black book. I mean another black black book, another in black book. That's a dragonfly. Not a very happy looking dragonfly, and that's a very colourful Velociraptor. That's expert spelling of the word scorpion. That's Scopian. Scopii? Scopiahan? Yep, that's not scorpion. That's Scopian. Whoa. Dinosaurs, what now? Okay. That's me again. Really weird looking dinosaurs here. That's a Carnotaurus. Look at that arm curve, I'm not very good, I was not very good at drawing arm. That is a dinosaur version of Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Okay. It's like how I make pony versions of stuff now except for dinosaurs. That's a, um, Velociraptor, I think. And those are bats. Stop the bats, stop the... That's a Diplodocus made out of the word Diplodocus. That's <laughs> sun, leaf, tree, on a trunk, branch. <laughs> That's pretty funny. That's a Triceratops. That's the land before time again. 
That is an Ankylosaurus beating up a T-Rex. That's pretty much the same whatever drawing that was before. That's a rhino. Not a very happy looking rhino. Glaze in the way. And that is an orca. I think that's Willy. Um, no it isn't. Because the flint's not the flint. I can English. That is a really weird looking polar bear. Seven years old. Huh? Why are most of the drawings in here when I was seven? That is a orca with a lot of barnacles on its face. And that's another bat. Hmm, okay. Another blue folder. Tame, what? By Tame Diesel Train Pictures. You're a liar. Oh, looks like there's a lot of stuff in here. What? The Rusty Buckets. In Melbourne. Melbourne. Is this like a book? Huh. It is a book about the Titanic. Who would have guessed? Whoa. There's a comic book here. Interesting. This is a train. Very weird looking train. Train accident. That is the most legit looking train accident I've ever seen. Um, that's a train track. This was... Okay, that's very cringeworthy. I am not reading that. <laughs> I'm just gonna put this back in here. You get a nice close-up shot of my bed cover. It's all black. Let's see, no, it isn't. It's green. And, um, is this a train? This looks like it's gonna be a train. Yep, it's a train. Probably from Tom's the Tank Engine or something. And that is apparently me. Without my mixed up here. Uh, that is a Christmas tree. Okay. Probably the most uninteresting book so far. Also, the cover line. Last one I'm gonna look at today. Um, no, that's Mount Taranaki in the background, and that's a lighthouse. That is a car. Oh, that's what's his name from the movie Cars. That is Optimus Prime. Huh, so I was a Hasbro fan before I was a Nazi fan. Huh, that is a really fat airplane. That is the Westpac helicopter. Oh, look at that. Uh, that is a really huge excavator. A lot of stick figure drawings. This is a T-Rex skeleton. It's like a whale mobile. There's an orca, there's a pilot whale, there's a sperm whale, there's a humpback whale. Interesting. Oh, this is a scene from that at the museum. Huh, okay then. That is an iguanodon. I have a thumbs and even looking like the actual iguanodon thumb. That's the lizard, I believe. No, it's a velociraptor. It's a... Alright. Uh, it's an ankylosaurus with a very, very, very short tail. And really messed up legs. I have no idea what that's supposed to be. It's like a velociraptor bird hybrid. It's a derpy alley from Ice Age. Yeah, more am also in the chocolate factory stuff. The squirrel. Hey look, another orca. Oh look, seven years old. Again, is there anything here that isn't seven years old? Probably not. Is that Angus? No, that's not Angus. No, I'm recording something. And that's an orca. Seven years old again. Jeez, a lot of these are seven years old. That's a Triceratops. A little dragonfly up there. Stegosaurus. Looking at a pile of eggs. So there's a little baby raptor hatching out there or something. Might be a Stegosaurus. Maybe not. That is the Plonicus with three eyes. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. That's the last I'll do. I am not very good at... Wait, maybe if I turn the camera around. Whoa. Hello, I can use the mirror for guidance here. Okay. So, yeah, that's the last, um, 
I'll think I'll look at. Maybe I'll like try and find some other old drawings to react to or something, but yeah, I just thought I'd make that as a random video to pass the time or something. Now, um, yeah, roll credit.